Bobsledding has been an Olympic staple since 1924. However, Team USA couldn't tell you much about the sport's history before hopping in the sled. I spoke with some of the athletes on Team USA's top sled before they make their push at Olympic gold. One B. One team. One push. Towards an Olympic bobsled dream that these athletes have had for a little while. Team USA is not comprised of lifelong bobsledders or historians of the sport. Not a whole lot, honestly, but uh, uh, I was a history major at Princeton, so I, I've been uh, reading up a lot on the sport since I've been here. I didn't know very much of anything. I mean, obviously, the movie Cool Runnings, like that's most of what you knew, but I didn't know how to get into it or, any, or anything of what it took to be a bobsledder. In this case, knowledge isn't everything. Being a premier athlete is. I ended up going to play college lacrosse at Mercer University down in South Georgia. I went to University of Virginia at Wise for college. I played football there at running back. I played football and ran track at Princeton. Tailback, which is super handy for bobsled. Did a lot of pushing. Dragging a couple of defenders still on his feet across midfield. Backgrounds in other sports is typical throughout the history of bobsled. The tricky part is getting these diamonds in the rough to Lake Placid. I jumped and touched my head to a 10 foot something ceiling and they saw the video and gave me a call. I thought it was a prank call. And um, he was like, hey, would you like to try out bobsled? I'm like, oh yeah, sure, bobsled. And he's like, no, I'll set up a personal combine for you. Hakeem competed in the 2018 Olympics, now working towards a second shot in Beijing. Others vying for their first Olympics, an opportunity they never dreamed of. I always was a field sport guy, and you know, lacrosse and football aren't in the Olympics. And I always thought the Olympics were such an incredible thing to watch, but I don't know if I ever really saw myself in that light. Honestly, not really, because I, I, I wasn't sure like what sport that would be in. <laughs> uh, but uh, bobsled has afforded me this like awesome opportunity. An awesome opportunity, but still tough. You get tossed like... And I was, I just had no idea where I was. I felt like I was in like a washing machine. And then I got out on the, on the finish ramp uh, and I, I did one of these, like I almost fell backwards because I was so disoriented. The ride isn't easy, but according to Team USA, it's worth it. It's a little surreal sometimes, but it's a, it's a cool feeling. And I don't know if it's ever really, if it's even really hit me yet that this is the year I can try to make that dream come true. You know? A young dream, but an Olympic dream nonetheless. Although some of these athletes picked up the sport later in life, some athletes have been training for bobsled from a very early age. However, all of Team USA has the same goal, Olympic gold. For the Sports Desk, Marshall Kramsky, NBC5 News.